Mm. I love fresh flowers. Hey guys, welcome back. It's Clancy with 1013 Vintage where we talk quality thrifting and everything fancy. And if you are new, welcome. Please hit the subscribe button. I would love for you guys to join my community. And let's get into some of my thrift finds, beauty edition. Y'all, okay. I I feel like I am going overboard with thrifting because as many years as I have been thrifting, I really haven't really dove into the um, beauty product section where a lot of thrift stores, they don't have a beauty product section or um, uh, a larger home goods section. They just really have like a lot of clothing. But y'all, I am in love with the thrift store that I have been going to when it comes to finding Lux goods. It used to be rare to find a, a, a luxury brand in the thrift stores because normally a lot of folks will bring them to like consignment stores or um, any kind of reseller stores or they would sell it on eBay. But yeah, now people are throwing their stuff away. I mean, they are throwing, <laughs> they throwing it away. So I got some goods and one thing I need to share is that a couple of weeks ago, I did a, a video of beauty products and they had these little beauty like um how, what would i say they um like mystery bags they were little mystery bags and i have been buying obviously this is empty but i'm going to show you what was inside um they had like little beauty mystery bags and this is when they put a bunch of products in one bag and they just sell it by bulk because it's too much to put on an individual shelf so Keep that in mind when I start sharing. Okay, first things first. Oh my gosh, I, I love this stuff. I mean, oh, I am still getting brand new candles. This one is by White Barn. And this is a new candle. This candle is in stores now. It's brand new. And oh my goodness, I am very familiar with this scent. This is the mahogany, mahogany teakwood. Oh, and I love it. I just, I'm actually gonna just put this right here. Doesn't it look really nice with my flowers? Oh. Mm, I love smelling roses, which tip for you, if you want to, Fill your house with beautiful flowers. Go to your local Trader Joe's. It's There are flowers that are very reasonably priced and you can always find a beautiful selection of flowers. They have like eucalyptus, they have different selection of roses, they have plants, and they're usually all under $10. So Trader Joe's, you can thank me later. Okay, guys, because I am, listen, I got this. Okay, so this right, right here was in the mystery bag. So this right here, this is the Shoei Moisture. This is a big block of, oh my God, my hair. Okay, Clancy, let's, 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 let's get this together. This was a, this is the, um, it's, a re, it's a quench and refresh bar soap. So it just smells, it just smells good. I'm getting this. I got this along with two other things in one bag for a dollar. So this right here, I mean, you can get this at like a Target or uh, I wanna say these are at Walmart, but these soaps are usually like $5 by itself. Usually like $4.99. So I got this. I got this, which was 50% off because I actually saw it a couple of weeks ago at the thrift store and no one got it because it was $10. But today, it was 
half off, so it's five. And it's brand new, it's fairly large. It's in a beautiful glass holder. And you know what, what I come to find, um, I find that when you get beautiful candles that are in a casing that you can reuse, I love it. You can always reuse this. You can actually insert another candle in here. You can put, you know, toiletry items in here. You can put makeup brushes because it's fairly, it's a fairly heavy um, candle. I like it. Ooh, this smells really good. Can't wait to burn that one. And I'm finding these candles unburnt at the thrift store. Look at this. And I'm gonna put like a little, I think I still have it. Um, I'm gonna put a little clip because I got, when I walked in, I got sold in one. I saw them all like together in a bunch, like nobody was touching the candles. And I'm like, do y'all know that these candles are like, for real? This one is the, the candle that I love. I showed you guys this before from Anthropology. I got this for $5. Look at this, unburnt. Oh my God. So this is three so far, guys. I'm getting, I have three candles. Um, I have another candle. This one is by um, Illum, the brand name Illum, I-L-L-U-M-E. And this one was $3. Look at this. And look at the casing of it. Unburnt. This is this is the scent of ginger. I mean, I so could light this up and put this in my kitchen and just smell the strong scents of like just fresh ginger. Oh. I mean, these are some of the reasons why I love thrifting. You can get something of quality in the thrift store and not really worry about spending your money because these candles roughly are like $40, $35 in the thrift stores. I mean, I'm sorry, in the, um, they like $30 in, in, in um, anthropology. So, and I think I have one more candle. So, and this one, is by Voluspa. Love this brand. This was $3 as well. I think they, oh my God, this smells so good. They burnt it, but it's still full. You can tell the difference. I think they like lit it and like burnt it out. I have no idea. I'm not even making up stories anymore. They, they didn't want it. They chucked it and it's mine. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay. So those are the candles that I shared. Now, the mystery bags, y'all. Let me, y'all not gonna believe this. Now, one mystery bag came, oh, this is one mystery bag. One mystery bag came like this. It came, it was this right here. Okay, sorry, let me, let me get this back out of the way. It was this right here, which this is like a moisturing cream packet, right? It was this Aquaphor. Now, if you guys watched my video, a um, couple of videos back, I bought a large one like this for like three bucks. I saw it. this one was in the bag, okay? And y'all, look at this. Look at this. Chanel moisturizing spray. All of this was in this bag. It was, oh my gosh, let me tell you how it was. And of course, y'all know all I saw was Chanel. That's all I saw. I just saw Chanel in the bag. So this is how they come. And they're called mystery bags. So they were like this. They were like this in a big bucket. So you actually have to like dig. Look at this. And of course, I didn't even know what this was. I just saw on the top. And I was like, $7, I, I'm taking it. I don't even know what it is. I'm just gonna grab it and I'll figure it out later. So I ended up getting this. And this is actually 
a body mist spray that you can just use, you know, when you're, um, and it's Coco Mademoiselle. And it's a spray that you can just use getting out the shower, going to bed, in the morning, a little fresh, fresh something for you, $7. Now let me tell you the other bag, the other mystery bag I got. I got three mystery bags, but I'm gonna be honest. I opened them all up because I was too excited. I was I started looking stuff up. Some stuff I chucked because I didn't want to know. But let me let me take the rest of these things out because it was only two bags that I got. And okay, so this was the other bag. I got two more bags, but I threw the other one away. So, but I know how they were lumped. So these two. These, these three were together, right? These three were together, and then these three were together for $2. Okay, let me show you. This one is called the Five Minute, five minute Facial. It's not even opened. It's, it's, um, it hasn't been tampered with, but it's by Skin Dope, which I did look it up. Um, I'm gonna look, I'm gonna look at a, a, a YouTube video to see if folks used this and what was the results for it because it is brand new. So if I if I were to try it, I wouldn't feel too skeptical skeptical about it because it hasn't been tampered with. The next one is by Beekman, which I do like the product Beekman. This is the it's it's more like it's a foot balm, so um, it's just like a thick. Um, it's, Similar to like a, a um, it's similar to like the Aquaphor that I got. It's it's like a thick Vaseline lotion um, for your for your feet. So I got this, and then I got something called um, Tribal Chocolate, which I don't know what this is. I don't even think I'm gonna use it because I really I really got excited over my my next bag, which was. Now, all of this, y'all, all of this was in the bag. It was in the bag for $2. Okay, this was in the bag for $2. And they're, I'm getting, I'm getting too, I'm getting too carried away. <laughs> so, this one is the NARS Skin and it's like a gentle cream cleanser. I'm gonna look this up too to see if what this is about. It hasn't been, I don't think it's been tampered with. No, it hasn't been tampered with. It still has a little silver closure on it. So this, and, and it's, it's brand new, okay? Then it's the Paracone MD um, Hand Therapy. So this is just, this is just a brand new bottle of lotion. And I wanna say this little bottle it's probably like 30 bucks, like retail. Paracone MD, it's a good brand. And my last find, my last little beauty home find was a brand new Laura Mercier body butter. Now, this is, this is just body butter by Laura Mercier. Y'all, I looked this up. I'm gonna put it up there. I'm gonna put it up there. This right here is like $150. But why? Why? It's cream. It's body cream. Answer given. <laughs> I know why. It smells stunning. Oh my gosh. So this is a pistachio. I don't know what this is, but this smells. This is gonna smell great on me. <laughs> this is why I am addicted to thrifting beauty goods now. So when you're going into the thrift stores, be sure to look into the small home goods section. Look for candles, look for dishes, look for utensils or knife sets that, that are more on a higher quality end. And most of all,
look for beauty products. I, you wanna make sure if they're a, like a lotion or a makeup, you wanna make sure you check the expiration date. But for the most part, people are just chucking their stuff. Like this is, I can't, oh my God. <laughs> I can't. It's just too much. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, click like, share, subscribe. I would love for you guys to join my community to look at more thrift finds that I'm here to show you. And yeah, let's let's uh let's help help me grow. I want to I love doing this. I cannot thank you enough for all the support that you guys have been giving, the messages, the emails. I'm actually making sales on my website and I appreciate you for even supporting me and purchasing uh, just the smallest thing that you love. The whole purpose for me doing 1013 Vintage was really to just thrift things and have other folks really enjoy it. I know my grandmother would be so proud that I'm pursuing this on a, on a, bigger, on a bigger platform, so. Yeah, um, I'll see you guys soon. I will, <laughs> I promise. Bye.